Welcome back to the channel everyone. So for today's video what we're going to do is we're going to take care of this surface rust that we have on our steel exterior door. Many of you probably have a very similar problem as we do and we have a pet that continues to come in and out of our home and what happens is over time it starts to rust on the surface. What I think has happened is when this door was actually initially installed I don't think that a primer was used that was appropriate to protect it from rust. So what we're going to do is we're going to get all of our chemicals. We're going to put some chemicals on here. We have a biodegradable chemical we're going to use to try to remove the rust. We're going to sand it down. We're going to seal it with some primer and then we're going to paint it to match all the rest of the trim and hopefully it looks good as new. So let's get everything together and let's get working. Okay, so we've got everything out. Let me show you what we've got. This is the Evapo Rust. It is a biodegradable rust remover. I've got a little bit here in this red cup and I'm gonna apply it to the door surface with the foam brush. Hopefully that will allow it to stay on there long enough that it dissolves the rust and we can rinse it off. I'm trying to avoid having to take the actual door off and then laying it horizontal. If for some reason we have to do that here later in the video, we'll do that. Once that's done, I'm going to use a wire brush to try to get the rest of the rust off. And then when that's all done, I'll go over with some very light sandpaper and then we'll wipe that clean. And then we're going to use our Krylon rust protector. And this is the, um, the rust preventative primer that I had mentioned. Once that's all done and dry, then we'll touch it up with the exterior color and we should be in good shape. Okay, so it's a few days later, it got really late on us. You can see that what has happened is the primer that we put on the door is now very dry. One thing we noticed is there still is some texture where the dog's nose continued to hit the door here. We sanded that down as much as we could in the previous video. We thought we were going to be able to get it all done when it was hung. We decided to go ahead and just bring it out so it's easier for you to see, also easy for us to work on. So, in order to take care of some of this rough texture that we have that's still here, it looks like it's some pitting or something like that, I went to the store and I picked up some Bondo. It's plastic metal, and so what will happen within four hours, this will dry to a metal consistency. I'll be able to sand it flush, and then all of that should disappear. Once we're done with that, I'm going to go ahead and respray it with some more of the primer, and then we're going to touch it up with the paint that matches the trim, and we should be all done.
Okay, welcome back everybody. So it is the next day. Take a look at how it turned out. We let everything dry and you can see that the spot that we repaired is completely fixed. The color looks very, very nice. It looks almost like a brand new door. Thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you again soon.